Cold War is now free for anyone who owns PlayStation Plus, so in this video I'll show you the quickest way to rank up yourself and your weapons. Do me a huge favor and hit that like button for me if this video helps you out, and be sure to subscribe for the best glitches. You will need someone to help you do this glitch, so check the Discord in the description if you need someone. Your helper will need to be sitting in the multiplayer lobby, and you will need to head into Versus Bots. Once in Versus Bots, open up Settings by pressing Options, and then have your friend send you three invites. You will need to open them and select View Player Details on the first two invites. Then open the third invite, and this time accept. Once you have joined their party, open up Settings again, and then have your friend back the party out to the main menu. Settings will close, so open it again, and then tell your friend to bring the party into Zombies. Once in Zombies, Settings will close, and this time leave it closed. Then have your friend go down to Private and start up an Outbreak game. As soon as they see time remaining appear, they need to quickly leave the party alone. Then they can quickly rejoin your party. Once they have joined back, go down and select Change Map. Select the map Golova and just confirm the pop-up. Now go back and select Team Deathmatch. Then select Start Match and just dismiss the error. You will need to be quick on this next part. Open up Social, go over to Manage Party and select Leave Party. If you forgot to do this, then you and your friend will be on the same team, meaning you will not be able to kill each other. Now just let the game load in. If you can create a class, then put on any weapon that you want to level up. You will also want to have a grenade as your lethal. Once the timer hits 950, you and your friend can kill yourselves to spawn in the middle of the map. If you do not have a grenade, then just run into the out of bounds. Now when you kill your friend, you will earn weapon XP and rank XP, and there are only two spots that they can spawn in, making it very easy to farm XP. You can take turns killing each other, but each game only lasts 10 minutes, so when the timer runs out, simply do the glitch all over again to get back into another bot lobby. This is also a great way to unlock operators and special calling cards. Every calling card you unlock will give you XP, making this the quickest way to hit max rank. You can also use this glitch to unlock the nuclear calling card, which will make all your friends jealous. If you select free to play instead of team deathmatch, you will only be able to kill your friend 30 times, but you will unlock the best nuclear calling card. Feel free to use the nuke since it won't end the bot lobby. Once the timer runs out or you have reached 100 kills, then you will see how much rank you actually earned. In one game, I went from level 1 to level 12, which would have taken an hour or more in multiplayer. This is also perfect if you want to unlock a bunch of calling cards and camos. Once you have the sentry turret available, you can set that up in one of the spawn locations to stop your friend from spawning in. Then you'll be able to get up close and personal for some easy kills. Hope this video helps you out, and if you want to see more like this, then be sure to hit that subscribe button because we got some great glitches on the way. And that's all for now, I'll see you next time.